Okay, there's a story about Frederick Gauss, the mathematician. Uh, of course, he was a genius, but uh, when he was a, a young boy, he used to frustrate his teachers. And for busy work one day, his uh, teacher gave, asked him to sum the numbers from 1 to 100. And uh, well, I think he asked the whole class this, and they sat down to work, and Gauss finished in just minutes. Uh, and when asked how he did it, uh, he gave us this technique. Uh, and we can use this to sum any sequence of integers, but just for this re this example, let's do something simple. Let's do from 1 to 100. So it's 1 plus 2 plus 3 on up to plus 98 plus 99 plus 100. Of course, you could add up all 100 of those in your calculator, but that would take quite a while. Uh, what Gauss did was notice this pattern. If he paired, let me get another color here, the two outer numbers, what do they sum to? 1 plus 100 is 101. Then he paired the second number with the second to last number, 2 plus 99, what does that sum to? 101. Then he paired third number with the third to last number, 98 plus 3, also 101. So he was pairing them, by pairing them this way you always get sums of 101. And how many pairs will we have? Well we have 100 number, we're grouping them two at a time so there are 50 pairs. So the sum of this sequence is 50 times 101, which is 5,050. So when you're working these problems from class, uh, just write out a few of the numbers to get your sequence down right, and look at pairing them this way, finding the pattern, pairing them this way, see how many pairs you have, and then it becomes a simple multiplication problem. That's it.